Ladies and gentlemen, welcome the cuttlefish. And no, I'm not talking about that boring old photo tone. I'm talking about the Houdini of the oceans, the David Copperfield of the marine world. This animal doesn't hide behind a rock, it becomes the rock. Its skin is literally a living ultra high definition screen. In less than a second, it can perfectly mimic not only the color, but also the texture and pattern of whatever is next to it. Sand, algae, a bumpy coral reef, whatever. It's like wearing a smart invisibility suit that adapts in real time. But hiding is for beginners. The cuttlefish is an artist of deception. When it wants to hunt, it activates a psychedelic light show on its skin hypnotic patterns that move and ripple to leave its prey completely paralyzed. It's underwater mind control. And in love, they are master cheats. If a small male wants to woo a female, but there's a big guy watching, it does something amazing. On the side facing the big male, it puts on its I'm a female, ignore me colors. While on the other side, it shows the girl its best alpha male colors. It goes incognito, gets its date, and leaves without anyone noticing. Oh, and if a magical disguise, mind control, and soap opera deceptions weren't enough, it has three hearts, green blood, and an intelligence that rivals many mammals. It is, basically, an alien that decided Earth was a good place to live. The cuttlefish uses its colors to deceive, to hide, to control. But what if I told you there's a creature that uses its color in a completely opposite way? An animal so confident in its power that it paints itself with the most striking color possible to shout to the world, dare to touch me.